Now I believe you just open and click on this video because your symbol mobile service does not work for the internet and in this video I will show you step by step how you will fix this issue. Make sure to subscribe to Variety to Stick 2 and give me a thumbs up and without any further ado let's find out. Now just before we start I want to pay your attention Symbol Mobile as the time I'm recording the video you can go Symbol Mobile T-Mobile and Symbol Mobile Verizon. Now if you have Symbol Mobile Verizon and your internet is not working so you watch this video step by step I'll show you how to fix this problem. If you have Symbol Mobile with T-Mobile this will not apply maybe for another video. Now the problem starts that your phone make phone calls but the phone doesn't pick up internet. You don't see LTE, you don't see 5G on the phone means your phone connected and registered to the network but there is some settings problem here we need to fix. I will go through uh, different steps so that way I can help you to find the right way to get this fix and hopefully together we will fix this problem for you. Now let me start with the first troubleshooting which is make sure your data is enabled in the phone. As you guys can see I do have the mobile data enabled but the internet is not working. Now it still doesn't work if you never restart the phone I would highly recommend turn the phone off, carry it back on, see if the LTE will show on the phone. Now if still have the same problem I would highly recommend if you know how to remove the SIM card leave it for 30 seconds put it back restart the phone and try again. If none of those work let me give you more steps hopefully we will get it fixed right now. And by the way all these methods apply on Android phone no matter what Android device you have. First step go to settings and then you can go to uh, about phone and then go to reset don't make factory reset, just make reset network settings. From phone to phone is different, but normally if you go to the settings, you should be able to see uh, reset is under about, or sometimes you find it just by itself. Depends on the phone. This is a Samsung device. Maybe your phone is not going to show the same exact steps I have. Then reset the network setting, restart your phone, and see if that will work or not. Now, if that doesn't work, let me give you more steps. Hopefully, they would be more important to get this problem straight out. Let me just go back here and first go to uh, the settings. And then what I need from you to go to connection. Also, this option is available with every Android phone from phone to phone is different, but always search under mobile network. Now, what we need, the access point name. You need to make sure the access point name is available. Normally will be defaulted in your phone track phone dot VZWENTP, as you guys can see here. Now sometimes this APN settings may be not selected. I would highly recommend to click here and select and wait a few seconds, see if the internet will work or not. Now if you still the internet is not working, then we need to change this APN settings. I will display all these APN settings on the screen. You guys will be able to see and take your time, pause the screen and write down the right APN settings for you. I would highly recommend a three different APN settings for Symbol Mobile Verizon. So the first one will be trackphone.vzwentp. If that doesn't work, all you have to do tap tab on it right here. And what you need to do, just change the APN settings. By clicking here, you should get the option to delete this APN settings and write a different one. The first one I will try if the first one didn't work. VZW Internet. And then just hit OK and go to three dots right there and hit save and make sure it's defaulted. Wait a few seconds, see if the LTE or the 5G will pop in your device. Now if that doesn't work, no problems. Go ahead, tap here, go to APN settings and try the third option, which is just internet. and hit save and also make sure it's selected here 
and look to the LTE and the 5G it should pop. Now in my phone it didn't pop because this SIM is not active but in your situation you must get internet. Other than that if the phone doesn't work trying all three different APN settings mean the phone is not compatible and we highly recommend you to change the phone to another compatible device or switch to T-Mobile if T-Mobile works in the area where you live. And I wish you guys find this video helpful. If it did and I help you to fix this problem, please subscribe to Variety Stick 2 and give me a thumbs up. Encourage me where I can upload more videos and help you more. And thank you so much for watching. As always, we'll talk to you in the next video.